Hello friends, this is Zots, uh, although there's something stuck on my tongue. And today we're going to talk about the folks on Twitter and elsewhere that complain about four slowdown perks. These are survivors that don't want to go against the same tedious perks over and over again, or killers that don't like the feeling that they need to run these very sometimes boring perks over and over so that they have a chance to keep up. But if we are precise, Four slowdown perks is not really the problem here. This is a build with four slowdown perks, and it's a terrible build. No one would even run this or complain about this. When people complain about four slowdowns, what they really complain is about four strong slowdown perks, like these. But the truth is, an average or below average killer doesn't really squeeze the value out of these perks too well. These perks are best on already very strong killers like Nurse, and killers like Nurse Funnily enough, are the ones that don't really need these. They can run perks like these, a mixture of info, utility, lethality, and regression, and they are often better off running things like this. This is a perfectly good build that a really good nurse will probably kick ass with, sometimes more so than the previous one. So, the issue with these perks is not really that they're the strongest, but that they are sometimes a bit boring and stale, which I can understand. But luckily for you, right now we live in the best time ever in DBD to actually try different types of builds and we have actually fairly reasonably strong combinations of perks with different flavors to them. And today I'm going to show you three different games showcasing some of these. Uh, my favorite, Hex builds. Slap one strong Hex that has good synergies with your killer, maybe two if you're kind of spicy, then put on Undying from the Blight, which will protect those Hexes and require survivors to cleanse more totems, and bam, now if they do the totems, you have Pentimento to actually slow them down after the fact. This is really fun stuff. Endgame builds are also really, really fun. With the addition of Terminus and No Way Out, you have amazing combinations. You can also throw in No Ed, Remember Me, um, Blood Worth, and all of these perks work well with each other. And Bitter Murmur can see, can let you see everyone else at the end of the game, and it gets boosted by Lethal Pursuer, which gives you a bit of a head start at the beginning. You can have beautiful endgame builds right now, with so many of these perks being fairly, fairly strong. And perhaps not on Plague specifically, but anti-healing builds on some killers also make a lot of sense. With things like Chlorophobia and Sloppy Butcher or Mangled Add-ons, you can have people around you not be able to heal. They will instead go away, and then you can single them out and pick them out with Barbecue and Chili. And if they stay injured on their gens, a single perk like Jolt can make the gens regress constantly and trigger multiple times since it no longer has a cooldown. On some killers, this can make a lot of sense. And now, we're gonna go and show you some examples of what these one regression and three variety perks builds can look like and how fun they can be. Please enjoy and spice up your gameplay uh, so it's actually a bit interesting for you and the people you play against. But if you want to run four slowdowns, you can still do that. Damn, heck. Oz Robs. Yeah, the Twins games were okay. I feel like I played a bit boosted, but... If I don't spot anyone, I'll reload in the middle or something. You could always, you can always rely on at least one survivor. Oh, not rely, but you can expect one survivor to sometimes spawn on the same side as you. The more common outcome though is that all of them are on the other side. Hello. Oh, that's a free hit maybe. Free down, who knows? I can kind of zone her out here. Oh, you cannot drop that. They're booning. I think that's a dead hard shot. That's very sad. Oh well, unlucky. We're never gonna see this lady ever again. Say your farewells. Hey, never mind. A couple of knives and we got her. Alright. Oh, we blocked the Shen as well! Sick! Oh my goodness. That is good fit. That is very good value. And we have two hooks nearby, maybe? Awesome. Alright. Why well, we turn it around a bit? It's not very common that you injure one survivor and catch another one with the blood favor, but that's a welcome thing, I guess. Let's kick this real fast. 
Coma. As I said, uh, Undying Blood Favor, one ball combo to make your first chases really dangerous. Uh, I think Darkness Revealed is awesome. Please don't do that. Oh, sorry, Chad. I, I tried to M2 and 2M1 to, you know, to throw a knife, but I remember, I just remember that I'm at zero knives, so when I tried to M2 M1, it just didn't attack. That's why I'm one there. Didn't pay enough attention. Okay. That was Undyne revealing her, I think. Oh no, maybe she, it's, it was the, it was the, it was Darkness revealed. Ah, sorry, my camera moved myself. Cause I, I got hit by that car. Or I bump into it, basically. That's pretty good. First gen's probably about to pop by the fourth Ada Swabber that we've been seeing around. Yeah. Okay, count to 30 seconds, Chad. Actually, maybe Ada is here. Yeah, this might be her. Maybe Deadlock wouldn't have helped too much. I'm trying to figure out if Deadlock or No Way Out is better. We had a match just now where No Way Out was horrible, pretty bad. I also kind of gave up and was like, eh, I'm not even gonna try. Oh, hello! Oh my goodness, that's really good to know. But then I don't see her, she hides. That is the best part about Darkness Revealed! Uh... Yeah, no Darkness Revealed this time, but... If they try to make a funny mo Oh, please try me, dude. Oh, I just saw scratch marks, they're not... He used that heart. Damn. Damn, you guys are in a tough spot, huh? Oh. Night and day, chat. Night and day. Oh. Well, I missed. What a dead heart? He did really good. But <laughs> guess it didn't matter. Okay, we're gonna start to throw knives because they're gonna try to pick up. Do you notice my throw rate going super high? That's because if you throw... The more knives you throw, the faster you... You you begin to dish them out. That girl is out of the heal? Uh, in your healing must be it, huh? Must... Has to be. Let's... Beta head on. There you go. So head on, inner strength. Uh, boon must be Claudette. It's hard to know what's going on. Hello. All right, good, good job, dude. That actually was a really good use of inner healing, man. There's not a lot of ways you could heal yourself that quickly without a beefy medkit, right? Instead of undying, use dying light. Uh, I mean, the perks sound similar, but they do very different things. I, I don't recommend dying light to anyone, honestly. It's a really, really badly designed perk in, in the current patch. Trickster could stab me any day. Oh, uh, is that so? Chad, are we gonna get another? Yo! Another free hit thanks to them not anticipating random auto reads. That's nice. Oh, this pallet's blocked as well? Alright. Hey, yo, ladies, what's up? You that hard, dude? Watch out. Damn, we just made this killer look really strong. Thanks, survivors. Appreciate that. Mm -mm. Hi, Oni. Thank you so much for stopping by. Maybe it really is a lot simpler. Let's see. It had inner healing. Soul survivor. Oh, damn. Uh, Claudia had a work on. I didn't catch that. She just on everyone else. David with a sick death heart, by the way. Jesus. She, he probably didn't think that he would pull that off and still die. <laughs> that was nuts. Yeah. I mean, I think deadlock might be easier, honestly. Then again, the thing about this build with deadlock is that if you have a bad start, I mean, they hide or something, you find a survivor, spring birds away, you lose two totems. 
it would feel really, really, really bad to reach the end game and have nothing helping you out. At least with no way out, you have that little bit of hope. But yeah, yeah, sure. Um, good build still. And no way out, deadlock, probably both decent. I think I'm starting to lean towards deadlock, maybe, maybe being the more consistent one though. All right, uh, chat. Oh, ch oh is that cheese? Cheese, not cheese. Wow, thanks, dude. I, I mean, I guess I have to say thank you, but. I don't know, man. All right. So we have a bunch of perks to make survivors have owie owls if they are injured. And our plan is to injure them by breaking the chain. If we do that, the thorny green add-on makes them mangle, which is like sloppy. And the other one makes their their mending take longer. So we're going to play this killer a bit like a budget lesion. But we're just going to... Oh, no. Cool. Yeah, we're, we're gonna try to like get everybody injured and see if that kind of slowdown actually helps or what I don't know. I, I haven't gone into this match with like a Preconceived idea of what we're going to achieve here This is pretty good. It's only three seconds stun. We do need to reload though, which is a bit of an issue All right, uh, three people injured. Honestly, it would be ideal now to bounce back. Oh Wow, got her Wait, the chain broke against that wall? Let's bring her out now. It would be ideal to go back. Wait, what? What? That guy's... What? That guy's healthy already? Hello? How? Uh, go back to Ace, I would say. Since he didn't need to mend. But no, he's already healed. Okay. How? Maybe he had two ladies helping him out. Uh, we'll figure it out. That shot? Yeah, I didn't... I, I thought I would be out of range, but lucky us. Healthy boyos? There was someone healthy here. Oh, okay, I guess they... I played the heck out of us. That should be a shot. Uh, you're injured, so let's down you. Oh, Jolt not having a cooldown. Thank you, dude. Thank you. I remember so many people asking me over the years, should Surge have a cooldown? And I'm like, nah, Chad, they'll never do it. They'll never remove the cooldown. But hey, here we go. It happened. Hope you're happy now. <laughs> I love this perk. It's just a shame that it's it's the kind of perk that works best on, on maps that are already good for you. But anyway, uh, I digress. He must have a heck of a medkit, right? To have healed himself that quickly. Chat, I tried to do some really, really bizarre flick. Never again. Let's get you close. Alright. Uh, do I want to go for Ace just in the spirit of keeping everyone injured? Maybe he doesn't have that many charges. Yeah, yeah, let's let's try. Let's try to commit to this Legion-like playstyle. Oh, oh yeah, <laughs> dude, I got you figured out, bro. All right, I hope I really do because I'm not gonna catch him. You really showed those tires. Listen, dude, it was a warning shot. All right, um, this uh, this. Auto Haven record place. It's in it's in one of those states that doesn't have stand your ground laws. Technically, they're not trespassing. So I don't have ownership of the place. So, oh my god, that was dirty. Actually, what well player, dude? Oh my god, what you did was dirty, but what I did was filthy. Oh yes, baby. If only it reached both of them. Nice, very nice. They're doing gents really well, all things considered, because they're staying injured. Ah, well, that's where nurses and Jolt should hopefully come in and help a bit, right? Because if they stay injured, I can reel them close to gents now. Ooh, baby. Mm, maybe, 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 barely, barely, barely. Stay close to the- stay close, stay close, stay close. You wanna stay injured? Yeah, you wanna stay injured? You wanna really suffer? I'm gonna do this, I'm just gonna do- I know I can't hit her quickly. But I'm just gonna I'm gonna do that so that his medkit doesn't heal him in a second. Oh, watch out, Fang is still around. I mean Meg. Meg? Meg, you greedy bastard. Okay, that was a good dodge. Ooh, what do I want? I need to make a choice here. Ouch. I feel I feel like I've been here. Damn it. Uh, I'm losing that girl and the gen if I take too long. Thank you. Alright, we go back, and if we get hurt, great. If we don't get hurt, oh yeah, we don't get hurt. 
So bad, yeah, it was a regrettable play. But we do have a hook nearby, and we've swapped one person for another, and the gen's still up, so I think that's important. And it's a person that's on their second hook, so I figure that's that's pretty good. That's not too bad. We've stabilized the situation, let's put it that way. Everyone injured, though. Damn, damn, I've never felt like I was able to keep people injured with that slinger before. But I think these atoms are doing their work. Damn, tough one, huh? Alright, you hang in there. I kinda wanna be in the middle of the two gens so I can hit them both. Ah, honestly, dude, I was so close. I didn't need to worry that much. <laughs> I just don't have eyes behind my skull, but sure, I think I think we were fine. I think that was 40 meters. <laughs> uh, I don't know, chat. Uh, maybe 41 meters? Yeah, no, we were fine. We were fine. We, we overthought that one. Alright, someone here and two people here. I know they want this end gun so bad. Well, guess what? I'm not looking to let that happen. Where's the other punk? Drop it. Yes! Oh my god, this gen has suffered. Oh god. The streamer BM? No, no. I never realized how cracked you are with Slinger. Nah, we were honestly lucky shots and... And not any crazy, like, super difficult... Spins they've done, you know what I mean? They've been a bit unlucky, honestly. Some of those shots at that, at, that, at that distance, if they just move erratically, you can guess, but even I've seen good. I'll just put it this way I've seen very good Deathslingers who definitely know what they're doing far better than me still miss mid range shots, you know? Because it's not a it's not a hit scan weapon that, that shoots immediately, it, it takes a bit of time to travel, and that just means more room for, for mistakes and whatnot. Maybe I could shoot through one of these gaps. I'm pretty sure this Nia's in trouble. Do I want to go for that boy, or do I not care? Mm, okay, Nia, you are the easier target, undoubtedly. Yeah, go for the window, see what happens. Uh, honestly, anytime they go through a window, it's kind of like Huntress. You let them do it, and then you bang. Punish them for it, I guess. Um, this is a, this is a bit of time, though. Alright, that being said, there are two gens who are doing really good. I think they're about to lose one player, but maybe I'm wrong. There's two Nias after all. Damn, I was wrong. So, three people that don't hook. And I think it's all of them except for Ace. Oh, nurses. Nice. Meg, you need to get the hell out. Oh my god. Dude, this pallet stop. Yeah, yeah, this Meg is... Wait. Meg, what are you doing? Why do you come here? You left scratch marks everywhere. What is this sloppy job you did? Oh, that bird took me. Um, normal hit, I guess? Normal hit. Do we feel bad for Meg a bit, or...? One heal, how dare they? Disgusting. They should have had this lady healed. Maybe that girl's dead on hook as well. Wait. Meg? Meg? I can't give you mercy if I can't find you! Huh? Are there multiple mechs? What is going on? What is happening, chat? I'm confused. Uh, she's too far. Alright, Meg. Uh, you had a second chance, I guess. She's gone? I think she had tenacity, maybe. And she crawled here, recovered, and then got picked up quickly. Good for her! Hi, Treyer. Thank you for the... Uh, six months. Hey, congrats on the Adepts, that's sweet. Thank you. Oh, hey, what's up? Sucks to interrupt healer against this, right? Oh, 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 oh. Got me a big one again. <laughs> oh, yeah, they've been very unlucky, dude. All these shots have been happening so far. <laughs> they don't they don't quite, like, expect it, I suppose. All right, I'm, I'm gonna assume that the crowd panic is real. And that they keep running. Uh, this is a thing that... It's a bit of a theory, okay? It's a bit of a theory, and maybe you think I'm full of S. But, you know, I'll tell you. And you, you, you tell me what you think, or you make your own mind up. When a survivor is being chased, oftentimes they make the best possible decisions, and they don't really worry about... They don't really make that in this rock. They don't really worry about sandbagging their teammates or anything like that. But sometimes when you chase a, a group, a herd of survivors, and you push them a certain way, they stop looking. They stop looking out for themselves, and they just they just hold forward and do the most simple, 
maneuvers. So if you chase two survivors into a building, generally you, you can sometimes just... Oh, that was a 99 Springburst. Oh my God, that was really good. You can sometimes just go past it and you'll see both of them come out of the other way, which they wouldn't do. All right, let's just set you in mending. Uh -huh. Now what? Dude, this this thing is kind of it's kind of messed up. I I don't think I make it. I think the I think the oh you were there. I think the geometry is just too complicated, honestly. You know what? Go men, lady. We're gonna take advantage. Of, I'm a legion, guys. I'm a legion. Dun 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 dun. dun. Music, just think of it. We let her mend. They might actually just beat me here. Everyone's let on hook except for Ace. I'm fairly sure. God damn it! Of course it's Ace that gets out of the way. No, this lady though is trying to be sneaky. Trying. You can shoot through these gobs. Painful. You're not able to mend with incapacitated. Really bad when you get slapped by lesion after eruption. Um, I mean, you can still run, right? You can just still run. And then you don't go down to mending. But, wow. I didn't know that, actually. I, I don't think that's ever happened to me. That's cool. I didn't know that. Um, do you think we could add it in some way? Hmm. Yeah, like, survivors need to waste time anyway, right? That's a cool fact, I didn't know. Got him. Oh, nice shot. Just keep aiming randomly and he'll try to dodge. <laughs> Bonk. So you come here after him? Huh? Fascinating. Oh, me too, me too, actually. No, but I had a cousin. Alright. That, that game was really fun, actually. <laughs> Alright, let's see what they had and whether or not our anti-heal actually did anything or, or what. Because if they had a couple boons and a better map for boons or something. Okay, they had one brown medkit that they used up almost at the start. Yeah, we were. Very and zero boons. We were very lucky, dude. Very lucky. And they're good sports. We love to see it. GG's. Well played, everyone. Did Ace have a dren? No, he did not. He had deliverance. He got hooked first. Ouch. That hurts. That hurts. Oh, we'll play you guys. Oh, gas heaven. I can, dude. I I have enough oil, man. Let me be. Oh, we have a fountain that honestly. <laughs> I don't know how we can use this. Maybe if we hook someone in the middle. Yeah, let's not pick it up. Let's just believe. Oh. This doesn't work, does it? Yeah, I know. The game would be fun if that worked. What about Mike Uchi? Uh, I don't know about Mike. Oh, really? So you just gave me a free hit there? Alright, cool. Oh. Oh, no. That's kind of bad, though. Ah, she took that window away from you, lady. Oh, nice one, though. I, I don't think I make that. Just a few seconds. I'll try, maybe, but... Nah. Nice cooldown, though. Oh, and it blocked itself again. That's actually a pretty big deal. Do I make it back to that window, though? If I take it from this angle, I don't think she takes the window or the pilot. Oh, unbelievably. This valley was pretty good. I just needed to wait a second there, honestly. I gotta, I gotta just ate that for free, huh? All right, my bad. Pentimento on that totem when we have a minute. Oh, uh, yeah, that's cool. That's really cool. Nice cooldown. Oh, that cooldown though. Oh, I'm right here. Here's what we're gonna do, chat. To make sure that they are red and dirty. Oh, really, dude? That's close. Well done. Uh, basement's an idea, but I'm just gonna do this. All right, sure, kick it. Bring it back up, puke on it. I'll puke on that too, for good measure, why not? Alright, puke on everything. Hello, Fang, you're gonna be injured in, what, a few seconds? Let's catch up. Don't forget, if survivors walk or just stand still, they don't actually... They don't actually get injured. Oh my god, literally everything, this... 
Yeah, literally everything here is blocked. Did they get another totem? They did. And that was crowd control. So windows now are a problem. But guess what, Torgens? <laughs> it's gonna be so slow now. All right, they're probably gonna do my first pentimento, and just in time we do the second one. Walk. We puke on it too. Why not? Wait. It's still, it was still puked on or something. Yeah, it was still puked on because the person that touched it was red. But it's okay. If you puke on it, even if you don't get points, the the timer resets. So maybe that, maybe. Oh my god! Oh my god! Wait, did this gem block by itself? No, you just stayed here. It was still on cooldown. Uh, do you make that? Nice, good that hard. Oh, yo. Uh, I think this ghost is smart. I don't think this will work. I can try this, though. Yeah, that worked. But why didn't she take the pallet, then? Oh. She has a decisive, maybe. Well, what are you gonna do? Drop it? <laughs> no, no, you can't. Okay, so... We still have... We, that, that totem over there is our blood favor. Still doing its thing. Hi, Genju. Welcome. Happy to see you catch a stream. Damn, dude, we're, we're, we're thriving, we're thriving. Uh, they're all red at this point, I'm, I don't know why I'm puking on this anymore. Mm. You could drink from that fountain at some point. Are you doing my totems there? No, you're not. Yikes. Uh, what an ugly fountain, dude. If I drink from this now, literally, they're gonna stay injured for the rest of the game, I feel. Let's go there, they'll have a couple. Hey. Wait, are there two of them in that building? Mm. Yikes. Uh, this is boring, dude. I don't want to camp with my power, but... What a... What a... Sh what a sad... What a sad use of my power, man. I had to go so far to get there. Oh, uh, I don't even know who this one is. Okay, you must be the one that didn't get hooked. About to find out, I guess. Hi. I have 20 seconds on my power. I'm gonna waste it all. Coming out of here, am I not? Do the dabs with the DVD forums? Yeah, they even reply there sometimes. Uh, Peanuts in particular replies a lot. Gives a lot of nice info. Oh! Well, you guys are in some... Some fine pickle. Uh, I'll just pick up. Claudette can go behind us and get the person off the basement. We're not gonna try to find her. She's the one who got hooked? Well, I don't doubt it, but at the same time, I don't blame myself too much for not telling the two Nancys apart. Oh, they killed themselves on her. Oh, okay. Why? I mean, I guess they weren't gonna make it. Don't you feel like there are a lot more trees on these maps now? Uh, yeah, at one point in the distant, distant past, in year four, when Ghostface came out, the developers decided to add a bunch more trees so that Ghostface could lean from them. They did that in in Macmillan, but I don't know if they did that in this map. Maybe this map already had all these trees. It is their fault? It's okay. It's just no one's fault if no one complains, I guess. Um, I'm not gonna lie. Going for this claw that should be a lot simpler. Well, not really, because she's got this pallet, I guess. She's never gonna drop that, by the way. That's better. Well, now they're all injured. <laughs> we can't really trigger blood favor anymore, can we? <laughs> Alright, fair enough. What's that? Bug? A bug? From using my red puke or something? Didn't Ghost come in year 3? Oh yeah, year 4. Year 4 was uh, Pyramid Head. Yeah, year 3. Year 3. 100%. We're now a basic M1 killer. Do we make it though? That hard. Uh, she was thinking about it. Alright, oh, funny. It was oil? Oh, really? It just looks exactly like my thing? Okay, dude. That is illegal. Oh, it's oil. It looks exactly like the red puke from play when it hits the ground. I mean, I'll show you if we ever get it again. <laughs> That's funny. Are you are you, are you you telling me that plague's oiled up? She sees me here way too well. There's no way. Oh? Well, that was a bit of a blunder, though. No, I need this pallet, bro. Come on, be stupid. Make a mistake. This girl plays really solid, actually. Oh, never mind. The, the moment I say that. Maybe she has the S or... No, nah, she did a totem. She couldn't have it. Who was year five? Year three was Ghostface. 
Uh, year four was Primidhead, year five was Nemesis, and year six was Dretch. It's easy to remember year four because it's the shame of Primidhead, remember? Yeah. Why the heck not? Just in case they glance. Uh, it doesn't look like they're going to. I've, I've noticed that survivors, by the way, have regressed back to the no cleansing rule. Maybe it's because I'm I'm using I'm not using apples. But yeah, survivors really are allergic to cleansing. That used to be the case because the plague had zero red fountains by default. So, you know. If they never cleanse, you never had a strong power. I told you she was thinking about it. She did have that heart. That person's over there. Do we wanna bother? Yeah. We have done. This building, man, I pff, I think it's really scary. Blood loss, level 5,000, though. Uh, get that heart, man. So, chat. Um, considering that I have two add-ons here to shoot my puke faster and, and not really have any fountains and whatever, don't you think they should have cleansed? Like, imagine if they cleanse on, on a fountain, like, over there, all the way over there, or the opposite map. I would have never been there in time. Even this default fountain was in an awful spot where I took 30 seconds to come in and out. They should have cleansed, I think. I mean, honestly, there's no point in dying to no cleansing. You might as well cleanse and try to live. Uh, these two hours, I think, were all pretty good. Oh, damn. Oh, they sent us here. I didn't realize. Damn, that was a... Damn, we really got some value out of each perk. I think that was awesome. 